Okay, I turned off the camera last video prematurely. So, something happened to my motor generator, I think, when I was afraid of uh, hooking it up because it might blow the voltage regulator with spikes and stuff. I think it did that because now my motor, usually you just plug it into DC, okay, so it's so simple, you just plug it in and it just zooms off, but there's something wrong with it, see that? Like, uh, 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 uh. I think I blew something when I hooked up the uh, cap and the voltage divider. And I also felt some spikes on the battery in the last video, so I'm guessing some spikes blew out my voltage regulator or the chip or something, so I need to look into this. But... I was charging a battery at very little cost to the uh, draw of the rotoverter motor. And uh, I was trying a few other things before I started. I got a bucket of transformers. These are about half of what I got. And I was using caps. Here's my full way bridge rectifier collection, another transformer. And I was planning on taking the run cap phase and powering the this with the run cap phase after stepping it down. And you know what? I never really stepped it down. I just I just slugged this uh, voltage doubler and those caps into it, you know, and then it had a good voltage reading, so I go, oh, this is good, but I didn't use a transformer to knock it down, so, but it's interesting how it works. I'm suspecting... Uh, Voltage spikes are getting through that don't show on the meter. That's why I got a shock. That's why I blew up the switching of this. I'm pretty sure. So anyways, so there's your typical experiment. Something good happens and then something blows up. And then you fix it and try to make it so it doesn't blow up. So, okay. Uh, thanks for watching.